Suppose an conducting rod is situated in a uniform magnetic field B directed downwards and then the rod is moved to the right with a constant velocity V. We know that the conducting rod has free electrons and also say free positive charges and these charges will experience force as they move across a magnetic field. We also know that the direction of the force is given by Fleming's left hand rule and the positive charges are like current moving to the right and these will experience an upward force. The electrons uh, are also moving to the right but they have a negative charge so they will experience a downward force. Now let's start moving the rod. The positive charges uh, start to move up because of the upward force and the free electrons start to move down. So these charges get accumulated at either end of the conducting rod and one end of the conductor is now positively charged and the other end is negatively charged. So there is an induced EMF between the two ends of the conductor. So this now behaves like a battery with an EMF and its EMF or voltage is equal to BVL where L is the length of the moving conductor, V is its velocity and B is the magnetic field. If we complete the circuit by creating a loop across the positive end and the negative end, current will start to flow in this loop. And this current will continue to flow till such time the conductor keeps moving in the magnetic field.